Okay, this is a quick flip of the TN that I just made. Um, it's not really a size because I didn't want to continue to cut the leather down. But this is it. This is where the stain was on the purse. I'm going to put some brads in that. Um, I also like this as the front because I stitched it. If you can kind of see it right there. And I really like the way it came out. So, um, I can't decide what I want to be the front. But the band comes off. It has four inserts in there. I think I can put more. Um, and this is why I realized I don't make traveler's notebooks, but I like them. Um, I didn't have the proper things to necessarily punch the holes. I only have needles. But this is it. I really like the stain. I don't know why. Put some brads on it. Um, but this is the inside of it. And that's it. And let me show you that, guys the size. So it measures approximately, um, as you can see, it's six. It's right at six by, let's say, four and a quarter. It's about four and a quarter. That's just the opening. But I will say the leather from the purse is extremely floppy. Um, I may put a... Um, I was thinking about putting, where is that piece of leather? There's a, I have a, this. Cut, finish cutting this and making a pocket for the inside to give it some more stability. So, um, that was it. I still have enough to make a standard size. Let me show you that. And I will be making a standard size, um, because I have plenty of leather left over. And I'm probably going to sew just another piece of different leather here. Um, maybe black and make it black and yellow like the rest so this could be one this could be one i could buy some stain and just dye that piece of leather so that's it guys from this piece of purse so i got that one so i will eventually have maybe four out of this one piece of leather so thanks bye